Hi everybody, welcome back. My name is Dr. Aviva Gaskell and I'm gonna be speaking today about whether there's going to be a sexual, romantic, or dating revolution in 2021. Don't forget to subscribe to our channel for more videos every Sunday and Thursday at 6 p.m. on how to motivate, meet, accelerate, and beat your dating goals in 2021. My name is Dr. Aviva Gaskell. I'm a clinical psychologist and I've helped dozens of patients overcome dating challenges. So my question for myself today that I kind of wanted to explore is, is there going to be a dating sexual or romantic revolution in 2021? There's been a lot of stuff that has been going on with the coronavirus and with this pandemic. And it feels like a really important question to explore. So couples are getting together, like have sort of hyper accelerated their rate of um, entering into relationships at the start of this pandemic. Um, people who have been alone have been alone for a very long time at this point, um, or mostly alone. And um, people who, uh, you know, are in couples and they're miserable are going to be getting divorced. They're already starting to get divorced, but are going to continue to get divorced at like unprecedented rates until they can wait till the pandemic is over. And so it feels like a really important question about, you know, is there gonna be some sort of like romantic revolution? Are people gonna say enough? And I think my answer is complicated. It's like perhaps, maybe. So one thing that I also think is happening is that even for um, couples, you know, who are together, um, you know, people who aren't necessarily alone in this, whether they be married and have children, whether they are just coupled, um, in and of themselves. And again, whether someone's alone, I actually think there may be like more flirting um, when we get back out there in like later 2021, once people really start getting, you know, vaccinated and mass, I really feel like people are just going to be like flirting. They're going to miss that energy. I think there may be like a period of kind of drudgery, but like almost like a reawakening. I also think that for the people who have been going through this alone or the people who um, have been coupled but like really miserable or really unhappy in their coupling and feel alone in spite of the fact that they're already in a couple, which that happens to a lot of folks, like you can feel alone even when you're technically with someone. I think a lot of those folks have spent so much time with their partner at this point, that a lot of them are just gonna say like, fuck it, I am done. And they're gonna leave those relationships. Again, whether that be divorce or whether that be just like getting out and leaving the relationship. And I think that's a really interesting trend that we're gonna see in 2021 too. So my question for you is, what do you think is gonna happen in 2021? What do you see happening? Do you see people like hyper accelerating their dating? Do you see people running from relationships that they're miserable in? Do you think there's gonna be some other kind of sexual romantic revolution? Um, loneliness has, it takes a strong toll on our physical bodies. And there's a lot of research about this. Um, the CDC, the World Health Organization, the WHO, and other world and other health organizations around the world are getting really interested in this. And so again, like as a part of this feeling of loneliness, but also as a part of the feeling like even within couples who are like okay and kind of survived the pandemic okay, I think they kind of miss, you know, connecting with other people maybe just like having a flirty conversation at the grocery store or whatever, um, or at their office, you know? Um, and I feel like that's gonna be really important. I also wonder if we're gonna see more affairs. So let me know what you think. I'm so curious, please comment below. Um, what are your predictions for dating romantic revolution in 2021? I wanna hear it. And don't forget to join betmeadate.com to meet all of your dating goals. Like, subscribe, and check out more of our content on YouTube at BetMeADate or on our website at BetMeADate.com.